What's good, you guys? What's good? It's your boy Joseph L. back with another video. Uh, I'm just going to give you guys a little quick update about the Fox original drama American comedy series, which is called Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Now, Brooklyn Nine-Nine was canceled by the network Fox, Fox uh, Television, you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, Fox is a major network that has some of the most uh, original drama series, like Empire, which is uh, broadcast on Fox. You also have the originals, uh, The Resident. Also, um, you have other series like Lethal Weapon, the the comedy series. You know what I'm saying as well. So, Brooklyn Nine Nine was canceled by Fox, but apparently, another network rescued them, and the name of this network is NBC. Now, a lot of you know who NBC is because you have a lot of those other shows on that network NBC so it's good to see that NBC rescued and picked up Brooklyn 999 you know what I'm saying so um, I'm just gonna state this I'm, I'm, I'm glad to hear that another network picked up you know um, I think it's in the fifth season if I'm not mistaken you know what I'm saying of Brooklyn 999 um, like I said I have seen probably one of the episodes I didn't just you know catch up on all the episodes and everything like that but for those of you who are unaware of Brooklyn 999 this is the story concept of the television show okay now I'm gonna read a little bit for you all right here we go Brooklyn 999 is a television American sitcom about a detective Jake um, Jake Peralta and he's also a carefree a carefree cop with the um, hold on, I'm trying to see here. He's also a carefree cop with the best um, with the best according has never followed the rules closely or worked very hard. And then I also said um, that changes when Ray Holt, a man with a lot of more, becomes the new commanding officer of Brooklyn's. Uh, 999 precinct all right now also you have as hope remains uh, Perota to respect the badge and extremely competitive colleague detective Amy uh, Santiago starts to close in on the hot shot cops arrest record other members of the precinct including sergeant Terry uh, Jeffords a devoted family man detective Charles Boyle a hard worker who idolizes Jake and Rosa um, Diaz. Ro Rosa Diaz. She's a sexy yet intimidating detective. Uh, civilian office manager Gina Lanetti is tasked with cleaning with cleaning up everyone's mess while someone while somehow getting involved in everyone's business. That's the story concept of the show Brooklyn Nine Nine. All right, so. You guys go check it out. Once again, this show is not airing on Fox anymore. Okay, this show is broadcasting on the network NBC. All right. Now, a lot of shows, we've seen a lot of shows got canceled by other television networks. You know what I'm saying? You have, uh, like on FX, you know what I'm saying? You had one of the most amazing shows called Tyrant. Okay, Tyrant was the FX original drama series. Um, premiered in 2014. And was canceled in 2016 okay so that's what i'm saying when tavern was canceled you you had a lot of disappearing you had a lot of disappointing uh fans you know what i'm saying and um a lot of fans disappeared as well you know what i'm saying they went to other television um uh, networks that that shows other brilliant content you know what i'm saying so another network could have picked up tyrant okay uh, HBO could have picked up Tyrant, uh, Showtime, you know what I'm saying, you know, because Tyrant is rated TVMA for mature audiences, audiences only, you know what I'm saying, which is, which they allow, uh, they allow profanity and things of that nature, so one of those other networks could have picked up Tyrant, you know what I'm saying, alongside you have um, another show that was canceled on the FX network, The Comedians, starring, um, um, 
what's the guy's name? I forgot. It's two comedians. I forgot their name, uh, but I seen the show a couple of times. It was pretty good, you know. NBC could have picked up the comedians, which was canceled by FX, and that was canceled in one season. Okay, so a lot of these networks they cancel shows because of the ratings. Okay, ratings. Once again, it's all about money. Okay, so if the ratings are not looking good, hey, they're gonna ask the show. You know what I'm saying? We are, we know these shows, these drama shows are good. They are they are awesome content, but it's up to the network. They have the call, they have the rights, and they will ask the show immediately if the ratings aren't there. So, like I say, I think this is an excellent idea for once again other networks to pick up shows that have that have been canceled or axed from other networks. You know what I'm saying? I think I think it's a wonderful idea. So. What you guys think? Um, give me your feedback, your comments, your views. Make sure you share this video. Thumbs up this video. All right, I'm Joseph L. You know what I'm saying? You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. You know what I'm saying? All over the web, man. Uh, thank you guys once again. Um, you know, like I say, I'm just, I'm just glad to see Brooklyn 999 just really picked up by NBC. You know what I'm saying? It's just a it's just amazing how they were just rescued just out the blue, you know what I'm saying? But then, I'm going to say within two days, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, that's that's really good news to hear. So, once again, it's your boy. I'm Joseph L. I'm out. Like, share this video. Thumbs up it. Until then, peace.